male primary spermatocyte diploid cell. Okay. Looks like prophase one. Here you have continuation of meiosis one with metaphase one, primary spermatocyte. Anaphase one, still primary spermatocyte. It's already, as you can see, dividing. And then finally, at the completion of meiosis one, you will form two new cells called secondary spermatocytes that are each haploid cells, meaning that each one only has now 23 chromosomes. Now, why do they look different? It's because this secondary spermatocyte is behind, meaning that this one is more advanced. This one has already begun and is halfway through meiosis two. What process of meiosis two is this? This is called anaphase two. As you can see right there, separation of the chromosomes. Anaphase two, while this secondary spermatocyte is still in metaphase two. Okay? All right. Then you have spermatids. These will divide into spermatids. And then finally, the spermatids will mature in a maturation process called spermiogenesis into these final structures called spermatozoa. Spermatozoa. Just give me a second, please.